What we present is a web-based Chinese sign language, hereafter referred to as the CSL Broadcasting System, whose function is to translate the text on web page into CSL. The deaf web users can access their information and collaborative web services on any computer connected with the Internet. In China, the population of the deaf was large, constituting a disadvantaged group. Illiterates and semi-illiterates among the deaf still make up a considerable proportion in China. Their first language is CSL, and they can narrate the web page naturally and easily. We believe that sign language animation is an excellent medium for presenting information to deaf people if it is installed with CSL video. It's an excellent platform for the web developers to present the traditional media types such as text, audio, flash on the web at the same time using the CSL broadcasting system. This system is very convenient for the deaf users because it's web-based. They can quickly access web content available on any computer connected with the internet and it's widely used in the coffee bar, the airport, etc. In order to broadcast the CSL, we need to use a sign language synthesis application. Sign language synthesis application has been researched in many aspects and the projects under development are recently becoming ever more numerous. For instance, Mr. Shantz and Poison from the U.S. developed the first software of sign language synthesis application in 1982. Later on, Professor Gao Wen from the Institute of Computing Technology of Chinese Academy of Sciences, Mr. Lofiko from California State University, Mr. Li from Japan, Mr. Frank and Thomas from Germany all have their own studies about sign language synthesis application. But unfortunately, they haven't installed it in the web. If you want to use, you have to buy one. What's the more? Sign languages cannot be internationally used because many countries, though not all, have their own specific sign languages. Our system can make the web accessible to deaf users on any web-enabled computer or device, regardless of platform or browser used without installing new software. The ability of this system to provide a sign language animation on almost any computer comes from its unique features. The web-based CSL broadcasting system runs as a web application in existing web browsers with low special permissions. To support this, we designed a sign language synthesis system to compensate web application limitations. She is a deaf girl in Beijing and is using a laptop to visit the website of the Beijing 2008 Paralympics and watch the game news at home. At first, she downloaded and installed the plugin of the CSL broadcasting system whose role is to download the three-dimensional model of virtual human and the sign language action driving data from the server. After the plugin had been installed, she can open sign language broadcasting system to watch the Paralympics game news presented via CSL in text. Look. She began to sit down over coffee, enjoying watching the Paralympics Games news to visit the Beijing 2008 Paralympics Games website. This is the typical news releasing system. If we click on the first news link, we will open the page displaying the news in text. There is a CSL button in the upper right of the page. If we push the button, a box of virtual human will appear and then it will broadcast the game news by visible CSL. So, the typical news releasing system can broadcast the news using traditional media and CSL animation. To offer convenience to these deaf users, the box of virtual human provides some buttons such as play, rewind, etc. Deaf users can browse animated sign language by typing the play, express, or rewind button. Other functions include the ability to start, pause, stop the animation. To explain the process of broadcasting work, we introduce the frame of the CSL broadcasting system. The system consists of the following three components. One, translation module. 
that makes natural language understood and analyzed in order to translate it into sign language gestures. Two, graphics module that supports modeling and creating sign language animation. Three, web module that provides a web interface for a web application in order to support user interaction, determines which frame to play, and coordinates the frame of the animation created. The translation model is to create and package the data about the segmentation of text and CSL synthesis set on the server. If the deaf user selects a sign language to broadcast the news, the server will release the data of CSL packaged to the client through the network, and the plugin in the client will call the driving method depend on the CSL data to achieve real-time accurate news broadcasting via CSL. Any specialists who are interested in it can visit the website of the Beijing 2008 Paralympics and try to use the CSL broadcasting system filling it personally. This CSL broadcasting system has been developed in consultation with deaf web users. In users evaluation of the system, 14 deaf participants, 8 males and 6 females, browse the web installed with the CSL broadcasting system on trail. During this evaluation, participants were asked to visit the Beijing Paralympics Games website and subsequently complete a survey about this system. All the participants were able to successfully complete the task. They think that the system can express successfully and naturally the meanings of text, their true and accurate sign language which can be made into the plugins of the browser. So, we believe that the client can use browser to download and install the plugins, browse effectively and independently the web. This research is sponsored by Beijing Education Committee. We thank all the participants caring about the project.